today we take a look at Homunculus and the Cradle of Time. Welcome, friends, to a new episode of Lineage 2 Hanging Out Today on the Chrono Server. I'm Clobber Stump. I hope you guys are having a great day. I logged in, and um, I I saw that I was dead. And then um, I went to the dead ski thing, and I, I said, oh, uh, go to the fortress. So it looks as though my clan has gained a fortress. Um, I've never been in this fortress, and I believe we have... Which one do we have? We have the White Sands Fortress. The White Sands... Oh, the foreman. Let's go talk to the foreman guy. This is cool. I was completely thinking about doing something else, but this is awesome. Um, receive port, door, expel outsider, fortress functions, uh, teleport. Okay, we can't do anything because we're not a fortress manager guy. Um, manage fortress, recovery. Oh, we can do things. Change, 15%. I don't know, does this just work? Oh, first usage fee, seven days, it costs 101 million. Okay, I'm not gonna set any of that stuff, it's not for me to f decide, but um, it does have recovery, and then it has teleports and things like that. Um, manage expert, what's this? I don't know what any of that stuff is. Interesting, can we do it? Whoa, experts list. The mother tree placement cost okay an enchanter dispatched by the mother tree gives buffs that help your adventures oh very interesting so there's other things you can do with the fortress very neat um does it do anything like give you passives um let's take a look at our passive skills um passives so we have race skills, occupation skills, clan hall, monitor. Okay. Residence Dominion, an ability given to a clan leader who owns territory fortress in PvP. It decreases damage received by 2% and increases XP and SP gain by 2%. Cool. Well, that's awesome. So we do get some stuff from it. Fantastic. All righty. Okay, very cool. Well, that's not really what we wanted to talk about today, but this does look amazing. What we were going to talk about today was homunculuses. Homunculus. Um, I hope that's the way you pronounce it. I don't know if it is or not. Maybe it is. I'm not quite sure. But the homunculus can be found with the heart gem icon. Now, what you do get for completing 105, 106, or 106, 107, 108, you, you get these... Homunculus enchant points, so we're gonna do those and We have a few of those and now we have these hourglasses, too So what we can do is we can use those instead of Going through and just clicking come to me and birthing one on your own What you can do is you can click the cradle of time and use these coins for two million Adina each um, To just click on one and then click come to me and we'll get one so uh, make sure you have a spot free. Um, we do have a spot free, so that's good. So we're gonna click on this and then come to me. And let's see what we get. Okay, we got an advanced water polo. Let's click okay, what does this guy do? So what does he, he offers crit rate. Oh, so he looks good, but he's an advanced. We want to get a luminous, so um, all crit damage received reduction. I mean, he does add P def and M def is what he does. So we're actually not going to keep him. Um, he does add crit rate, but they all add crit rate. So um, we're going to get rid of his. He does P defense. So we're actually going to perish him. Now I have two other ones. I've got a Earth Chirong and a Water Ari. So these are both good. I've started putting points into this because um, when you do enchanting, um, you can level her up. So if you click on enchant, you can level them up with these. But if you click enchant here and you start getting these, you can add more. Now we can't get this one because we're not level three. 
but I didn't want to put a whole bunch of things in, but it was nice to get the extra two constitution, uh, mentality, luck, and charisma. Nice to have. So I thought that was a good way to start putting some points in there, but let's see if we can get ourselves a, we're going to use all of these right now, and we're going to see if we can get ourselves a luminous. Um, I'm hoping we can get a luminous Chirong. So a lot of times you get these generals and you get these um, advanced, which are, are okay. So yeah, you want to see if we can get ourselves a luminous. Can we do this? No. General Chirong. All right, so we've got three left. We're going to go try to do this somewhere else and get a, maybe ourselves a little bit easier. Let's go ahead over to... Dion. You know, we're so lucky in Dion. Um, I don't know if you guys saw the last stream, but oh, I pooped my pants. That's not good. <laughs> ah. Okay, so let's get the sweet tunes of Dion going. I want to show you guys what I got in the last live stream. And if you didn't see it, you guys should go watch it. It's my great, it's called uh, Great to Be Back. Um, it is in the playlist, so you should be able to find it on my channel. But check this out. So, Last episode, we got one of these, and it was the Enchanted Leviathan Sigil. And we bought the Sigil, and then I plussed it up to five in three tries. I, I did two, I, three, three clicks, and I got it all. So that was perfect. And then, look at this. Look at my uh, Augment. I have a physical, critical, physical skill, critical damage, plus 20%. I said I was going to get the top one in three clicks. I did it in two. And I did this on stream and it was live. It was awesome. <laughs> so amazing. I can't believe it. And then uh, we got ourselves a Greater Khalil's bracelet up to plus five too. That one took us a little while. It took us at the end of the stream and we didn't do very well, but that's okay. We can get more of those bracelets. I went through about a hundred of these uh, waiting, but um, that was funny. So, all right, let's do this. Uh, we're gonna do that and then let's do come to me and let's get an advanced. Oh, we got an advanced Ari. We already have one of those. Let's get rid of him. Oh, I mean, I want a luminous. A luminous? Give me the red one. Red one. A general Popo. Oh my gosh, look at it. Oh, what are you do? Oh my goodness, crit rate. Enchant. What do you do? Armor enchant rate. Oh my goodness. That is awesome. So this is good for like enchanting. It gives you max 3% armor rate or in armor enchant rate and then weapon enchant rate. Oh, that is kind of cool to have. Now we would really want to have the, I feel like I want to keep that, <laughs> but we're going to get rid of that because we could get ourselves an advanced or a luminous. Um, that is really cool, though. So we're going to perish him, but that's neat that they have that uh, ability at this point. So, all right, one more. Let's see what we get. Are we going to be lucky? Let's get lucky. Bam, give it to me. A general AI. Perish you. Bye. Okay, that didn't work. Well, that's fine. We didn't get any. I got these two. So I would say we're going to keep putting points into this guy. So we have 40 points. I don't think that's going to get us to the end here. But we're going to put it in here because we need to get to level 3. Because right now we are level 2. Um, level 2. So we are 40% through. I don't think we're going to make it. But, yeah, we didn't quite make it. So what we would have been able to do is when we get to level 3, it then gives us the ability to use the third thing and then fourth and then fifth. So, yes, I know that was a bunch of points. We spent a bunch of things. But that's okay. We got it. We enchanted. We used up a bunch of SP doing it, <laughs> but that's fine. So now we could use this. One thing to note uh, when you use the Cradle of Time, if you have one um, coming to you already, uh, this will you can't you can't summon any. So you have to have this all done. So don't have one coming to you. Uh, you'll have to finish that before you use any of your Cradle of Time uh, homunculus hourglasses, just for reference. So. Um, there we go. That's homunculus is in a in a nutshell. Uh, but the nice thing is, is as you level these up, um, and you click enchant, you can when you click on these, there's like this thing that comes up. I'd like to show you, but I, I used all my points unfortunately. And uh, it's like a 
looks like a wheel. It looks kind of like gambling. And you just have to keep clicking it until you get all three of these filled in. Sometimes it gives you one, sometimes it gives you two, sometimes it takes them away, and then you get another one. And then what you can do is you just keep going until you get three. And when you get three, then you got to level them up again. So, all right, there we go, everybody. That is homunculuses in a nutshell, and um, specifically the Cradle of Life um, particular portion. So, thanks for watching, everybody. I hope you enjoyed this episode. We were not lucky this time, but thanks for watching, and I'll catch you guys in the next episode. Take care and be well.